Hello, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Um, we've done our first set of classes. Um, we've got our wand. We've learned a few extra spells. We've leveled up slightly. And yeah, we'll just get back into it. And what I might do is do the main quest with you guys, and then side quests I might keep to myself. Unless it's a particular side quest, then yes, I would include it. Alright, so now we need to go and get our scrolls and potions. That'd be handy. This things we need to go to is potions, quills. Uh, yeah, hey, once again, how's everyone doing today? Good to hear. <laughs> Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art to potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? A wise decision. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. this game though like it's like I've played some of the Har old Harry Potter games like PS2, PS1 and like Chamber of Secrets and the um, Prisoner of Azkaban and again limited to graphical fidelity at the time never really captured the whole essence of the films but I feel with this this is a nice little touch. Oh, and there's a page for me to capture as well. Mine. Well, hello there. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the ditany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. 
Well, bravo. Anything with this. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dipney seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. No one can say I don't keep a stacked shelf. Revelio. Oh, I saw something. <laughs> the only one niche thing I have about this, but I know this game's meant to be for all audiences, not just the fans. Nor is the the dialogue seems a bit. I want to say childish. Just. Just things that are like, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, well, kind of takes you out of the moment. Like, you'd be walking around and you talk to someone, but it's all very lighthearted and all that. Like, I know you have your own choice in this game, but it just seems like your character is very dull, no matter what you make. That. So one thing else my friend pointed out to me when she, she was playing this game, every cat she paid, I had the weird meow. Oh. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to lock people over sales. <laughs> Another thing is the true Hogwarts experience than breaking and entering the home of it. <laughs> Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts, Professor Weasley. Get to our friend now. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. All right. That was convenient. Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it. We'll wear him down eventually. Sebastian, buddy, you're right. Whoa. What was that? A taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. Oh. Whoa. Right, lovely. 
He's out. He's faltering. You won't get to do the job. Invoke ancient magic. Hello. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? What did you see? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help Peter is a Swipe bit me. of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. All right. Oh, hello there. Repair it. I'll go and see what he wants. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. That's very kind of you, Mr. Hill, but I can't accept robes that I didn't pay for. Nonsense! I insist! Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Okay, so we get you won't be disappointed. That That's a improves our abilities. I'd say that looks as if it was made for you. Fuck oh, <laughs> I suspect you have a sharp eye for facts. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. Ah, oh, yes. I sell even more. Rebellion. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is. That if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Oh, no. 
So, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say... Trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh oh. Well... Time lane. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had Friends. enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. <laughs> oh, dear. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I'm not trusting to Sebastian. I think we should head back to the castle. Perhaps you're right, buddy. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Harlow. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Let's return to your common room at night. Access the Yeah, I don't like them using, like, when you're using control anyway and using the um, mouse cursor and all that. It's just that, again, needs to stop. <laughs> just fell asleep on the floor, fair enough. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The yes, trolls that's what I were just said. distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Sorona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Their 
after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. Oh, I'd like to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. <laughs> but sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Might put as much of the running segments in this game as well. I just feel like Revelio. Very tedious. Ah. All right. Oh, not again. Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice a mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boys' lavatory. Not for the meek. Please, please, you'll make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed, as did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. It was granted my privileges be handsome indeed, or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw up a contract with her, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swim. Whee! I'll get you for this. <laughs> level one lock, but I'm level three. Do I need to actually unlock the contagion? Okay. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Why not? Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in cross ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! That voice is a bit off. <laughs> we'll make you regret signing up. All right. <laughs> Break the yellow shards for control spells like levitation. Um, okay.
Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, yeah. handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. Oh, you may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. In two rounds of crossed ones, I've done one round. Seems bad. crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. Hello again, friend. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? I'll Do be dueling solo. solo. Then let's get to it. <laughs> Ready to get thrashed. Oh, they're just putting two against one. Okay, handicap match. All right. Oh, free. All right, let's do this. We got this. Dodge that. I dodge that. Akio. Mother. What? So close on the health. It could have been dead. Bravo. I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance of winning. <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. 
The next I love the combat the system. Stone, so, to speak. so far. The last thing we do for today. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate... I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Incendio. Incendio. Getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. Akio. Leviosa. Incendio. Catching things ablaze is certainly a isn't it? I think we're in this now. Um, thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this as much as I have. This uh, is quite a lot to take in. And yeah, subscribe, like, share with your friends, and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.